This is just the beginning of the protests. It's obvious that the Nigerian working class, the Nigerian youth, the suffering masses are completely against this insane attacks that have been carried out on the already overburdened Nigerian people. We have come out, we have told the government of the day that we say no to increases in the prices of petrol. We say no to increase in the price of electricity bill. We say no to increase in school fees in various universities. We say no to withholding of lecturers' eight months salaries. So these are the, you know, the demands of the Nigerian people. And this is just the beginning. And we are also putting pressure on the leadership of labor. The labor leadership must lead other strata of the Nigerian society in this heroic and historic battle to defeat all the attacks that have been carried out. So yes. we don't want labor leaders to sell out. The Nigerian masses are putting pressure, they are putting demands yes. on the leadership of labor, yes. including the Lagos State NLC leadership, because we heard when the leadership said the, the government is trying, the masses are saying that the government is not trying at, at all. all. The government is not trying at, at all. all. People are hungry. People cannot, you know, go to, to go to their places of work. People are trekking every day, long distance. So these are the position of the Nigerian people. We want a reversal of the increase in the pump price of petrol. God bless you. We want reversal of the electricity bill. We want our lecturers to be paid their eight month salary that is being withheld under the no work, no pay policy of the federal government. We also want reversal of all the fees that have been imposed on the Nigerian students in various universities. English. Ideally, I would want the, the Labour Congress to continue with the protest. So far, so we can put the government on their toes. So the demands, even when they came here, the demand they place here is it's summer national team. They need to make some project demands that will lift the populace, the masses out of this poverty. So I am I won't be surprising the NLC embark on the suspension of the protest, but I want them to continue if it can even last for a week. So the government can hear our demands, they can hear our yearnings, and they can act accordingly. The government should heed to the cry of the masses and to the requests of the Trade Union Congress and the uh, Nigerian Labour Congress. Searching for schools for your child doesn't have to be a difficult task. With examcenter.ng, you can search and apply to top schools for your child in minutes, literally minutes. Let me show you how. Visit www.examcenter.ng and click on the Get Started button to begin applications into schools. Complete the bio data form displayed and proceed to login. Make sure you check the top right corner for 100% completion to begin applications into schools. Click the Applications tab on the left and select the Apply button in the top right corner to apply to schools. Remember, you can apply to as many schools as you want with just one profile. The expectation of everyone present here is for us to have a better Nigeria. The situation on ground now is so, 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 so pressing that um, you, can hardly, you can hardly survive under this intention. In a, in, a, in a country where there is no consideration for, 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 for the citizen, I, 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 I don't know how people can even be productive. It's so, so unfortunate and uh, the leadership we have, they, they never show any care for our, for our plight. And I don't think it should even get to this stage where we will be having rallies, protests here and there before they can do anything.
there are lots of a lot of saboteurs here and there who is making things difficult. But I just know that we are going to overcome. Uh, we don't think this is a protest. This is just a, a showbiz. You know what we call a showbiz, really, uh, because you will see that even the generality of the mass of the people are not in relations in whatever way you know, with what has happened then yet today. Uh, the bureaucrats, the leadership of NLC in Lagos, clearly do not understand why the Nigerian people have got to be on the streets, why they have got to struggle. Uh, you can see that in their countenances, you can see that in their behaviors. You, know, you can see that in their reactions as to um, the event that took place today. So for us, we are, we are um, not really, really you know, taken aback because we know that this has always you know, constituted the, the basic norms of the uh, organized labor as far as we are concerned. But we are not giving up because uh, this struggle has to do with the generality of the mass of the people. It's about the people, not about NLC, not about you know, organized labor itself. It's about the future of our country. And when it comes to the future of our country, you know, uh, we have got to think about um, the future. We have got to think about posterity, not about uh, the limitations of what we are facing right now. Continue People are suffering. The IT called you. Come find solutions. You find solutions to this situation. It's too much. You know they. You know when they are going, they are going to march. They are going to march. At the top of the local, they are missing the local. Oh, she go. What are you going to do?